This festival brings back so many memories. The Puerto Rican festival will decorate the New Haven Green with Puerto Rican Pride Saturday. Joseph Rodriguez is with Puerto Ricans United, which puts on the event every year. He says the Puerto Rican culture is a passionate and family-oriented one. Being able to get together and share the love of our culture with the broader New Haven uh, community uh, is, is special. The president of the group says New Haven is home to more than 25,000 Puerto Ricans and more than 300,000 statewide. In fact, he says 50% of Connecticut's Latino population is of Puerto Rican descent. It just feels good to be able to come together and celebrate who we are. There will be live music from seven different bands. Four of them are flying in from the island to play. People will also have an opportunity to find a job. And of course, it's not a festival without some flavor. Twelve food trucks will drive into the event Saturday. And we're very excited to be part of the event. Michelina's Pizza Restaurant will make its debut at the Puerto Rican Festival. They opened during the pandemic and are excited to build a brand in New Haven. We expect you, you know, to come down, show support to everyone that's going to be um, bringing their food trucks. The event has been canceled for the last two years because of COVID-19. The festival itself only launched six years ago to bring back the love for the Puerto Rican celebrations of the 1980s to early 2000s. Now that it's back in the Elm City, the excitement returns too. Enjoy our rich culture and enjoy the melting pot that is New Haven. Excitement for festival goers and those looking to feed them and celebrate the Puerto Rican culture of New Haven. It's going to be our first time there and hopefully not our last. They say come hungry and bring your dancing shoes. I don't know if these qualify, but hey, these boots were made for both work and play. The event starts Saturday, one o'clock here at the New Haven Green. In New Haven, Tony Black, Fox 61 News.